When I was a kid growing up in the 70s and 80s, there was a race called the GATR, or Great American Truck Race, which featured trucks racing on oval racetracks, much like NASCAR does today. I really liked the opening sequence to Smokey and a Bandit 2, which featured the snowman driving his GNC General in a GATR race, or Great American Truck Race. Sadly, these races were ultimately banned from America for a short period of time while they continued over in Europe. Fast forward to 2019, where I had the opportunity to take this 1995 Ford L9000 to a truck show and to drive it on a New Jersey motorsports racetrack located in Millville, New Jersey. So let's watch some film footage of that. And also, I talk about this truck during this video and then capture some moments of racing. Live at the South Jersey uh, truck show here, Millville Motorsports Raceway. As many of you know, I've been working on this gem here for the last three days. This is a uh, 1995 Ford L9000. Uh, the Ford has a uh, 3406E cat under the hood, which makes this truck uh, pretty unique. Um, most of these L9000 had the smaller cat 3176B or a uh, Cummins L10 under the hood, Cummins M11. So I spent some time uh, painting the frame, painting the engine, detailing the truck up. Um, I've entered a couple different classes here, so we'll say we'll see how I do. But mainly, I'm out here just for let me get out of the way here, just for fun. So you guys can see the back end of it here. But this truck here is actually a, uh, a working truck. It's not really a show truck. Um, it's actually used on our farm at the place I work at. So it is a it is a working truck. Um, I am geared up and ready to roll on the racetrack. I am taking this out on the racetrack. Um, I already made up my mind earlier in the year, so I'm actually looking forward to that. Like I said, I spent uh, about three days on this truck, getting it to look this good. Um, not perfect, but uh, it's what I call a, uh, a good tenor. They were talking about starting a race at 11.15, um, but I think they want to get the judging done and over with first before we go out on the racetrack, and I'm good with that, because I did enter the um, judging contest with it as well. I figured if I poured eight hours worth of work into it, I might as well go ahead and let them judge it. So yeah, like I said, I spent uh, three days getting that ready. I'm here at the South Jersey Truck Show here at the Millville Motorsports, uh, representing my company, uh, Pipco Transportation. This is the Pipco Farms truck. Uh, it is a truck that's used every day on a farm. It's not a, really a show truck, but I thought it cleaned up pretty well for the condition it was in uh, when I first got it, 
And uh, like I said, I, I detailed the engine up pretty, pretty nice. And uh, it's got the the big Cat 3406E under the hood. Now this truck, this truck's got a lot of engine for a little truck. 3406, that's pretty big engine. Um, biggest Caterpillar you could get into a, such a small truck. Um, so I'm pretty excited about the, this because I, I'm going to I'm going to I'm really going to take this thing out on a Millville Motorsports racetrack. I'm pretty excited between the, the race and the, and the uh, and the competing in the trophy class with this thing. And you can see the, there's other trucks. There's 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 plenty of competition. Uh, there's plenty of other trucks down here. Um, so the plan is uh, between the dash cam footage that I'm going to shoot and the person that I have here is going to be in the stands. They'll be shooting video. Um, hopefully, I can put together a nice uh, video of you know turning around the Millville Motorsports and the Mill. For those who are not familiar, the Millville Motorsports. Uh, track is um, a road course. It's not an oval. It's an actual road course. And again, uh, I did enter uh, the the uh, competition for trophies. Uh, so we'll see how I do with that. But here I am, Millville Motorsports uh, racetrack with a uh, Ford L9000 in competition and uh, getting ready to uh, hopefully get out on the racetrack soon. Alright, I'm back. They called us out. So, getting ready. Getting ready for the truck truck race on a Novo Motorsports race run. I do have somebody uh, recording with me. We're all lined up, ready to roll. Have some fun. Tear up that racetrack with these trucks. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I've been looking forward to this all year long. We have these big line of trucks that are getting ready. Sorry about the shaking video, but I'm so nervous and Excited at the same time, but I'm shaking the phone, so it's hard to keep the study. So sorry about that for the shaky uh, video, but it is what it is, and we're out here right now, Millville Motorsports Racetrack, with the thunder of trucks getting ready to go out there, and um, boy, I'm excited for this. Um, real excited. Once again, Novo Motorsports Raceway, Novo, New Jersey, South Jersey Motorsports Race. So, once again, this is a road course track. This is not an oval road course track. Oh yeah, Cindy, I am, I am good to go. I'm going to have a blast. Uh, this is like a dream come true with, for me because I used to watch a lot of truck racing when I was a kid. Uh, a lot of people don't realize there was actually big rigs like this. They used to race on oval tracks. So having the opportunity to say I was one of the few that drove a truck on the Milvo Motorsports racetrack is... Uh, is that alone is uh, exciting. And look at these trucks, they're all lined up. They're ready to roll. We're ready to run that damn racetrack. We're ready to tear it up with some truck thunder. I, I am getting on that racetrack. I'm in the line, I'm in line up right now. There's my truck. There it is right there. I spent three days getting that truck ready for this, for this event. Three days. She's equipped with a big four 34 C cat. Um, 
a spring rod suspension. This is what I'm driving. Uh, like I said, I spent three days getting this truck ready for this. Um, this is with permission, of course, of the uh, company owner. He knows that I'm going out on a racetrack. He knows that I'm taking this truck to this show. And he's in full support of everything that I'm doing with this truck. So it's not like he doesn't know about it. This is not my truck. It belongs to... Uh, uh, Pipco Farms, owner of Sam Pipco. But uh, he does know that uh, I'm racing on this, on this racetrack. Uh, once again, what they're doing now is they're making sure that the trucks are all going to make it under a bridge because on this road course there is a bridge and the trucks has to be uh, 13 foot 3 inches or less. Uh, so there is a bridge on this ro race course, uh, believe it or not. So not only is it a road course, but there's a damn bridge on it. So <laughs> that makes it kind of interesting. Um, i never actually been on a road course track before. This will be my first time with anything, let alone a, a, a truck. So I'm pretty happy about that. Glad you guys are with me on this live feed to... Uh, for this event because this is this is a once in a lifetime thing for me. I mean you don't have if you have uh, my thing is if you have an opportunity to do something now do it don't wait till later because you never know what might happen in the future you might not even be here tomorrow so all right looks like they're getting ready to move um forward so I gotta get going okay here we go going out there on a Millville, New Jersey Motorsports Racetrack, road course track, with trucks, under trucks on a New Jersey Motorsports Racetrack. Look at him go. <laughs> Thank you.
To see more truck racing action, please check out the description of this video for the link of the actual video that I made called Thunder of Trucks on the New Jersey Motorsports Racetrack, which shows all the truck racing action. Hello everybody, having fun today at the South Jersey uh, Motorsports, actually New Jersey Motorsports uh, um, Raceway track here, and uh, behind me, you can see the, the Ford that I uh, had on the track earlier, I'm still here, um, in competition for a couple categories for uh, trophies, so we'll see what happens there. But, uh, so far I'm enjoying my day, um, nice day out, sunny, couldn't ask for a better day. Uh, got three laps in on the racetrack, you guys already seen me post photos of that. I did have somebody in the grandstands recording and I did get dash cam footage, so I have all that. So um, I couldn't ask for a better time out here. And um, you know. All I can say is, uh, is if you have an opportunity to do something you've always wanted to do, don't put it off, just do it. I mean, that's my advice to you. And, uh, you know, getting to run a truck out there on a, on a New Jersey Motorsports racetrack, road course, uh, that opportunity doesn't come up often, especially you know, I'll be, I'm one of the few that can say that I raced a truck, a truck around the New Jersey Motorsports racetrack and I don't care what else happens. I mean, that, that was just icing on the cake. I mean, I just love, I wish I could have more laps out there. I mean, that was, that was great. I had a blast. And uh, like I said, I'm still here. Now I'm in competition for uh, trophies in two categories. Uh, that I signed up for so we'll see how the truck does it's not perfect and I'm not expecting anything win or not I don't care I was here to have fun I did what I wanted to do I got out there on that racetrack and um, you know that was uh, like a dream come true to me because as a kid I watched trucks racing around an oval track and to actually take a truck on a road course track with all these snake turns and hairpin turns and you guys can see it on video uh, me downshifting and all that stuff going through them turns that was awesome uh, and uh, that, was, that was a great experience and I would do that again in a heartbeat uh, but uh, yeah so still here uh, there's my Ford behind me well not mine but the owners uh, out here I've been in contact with them all day so he knows what's going on, what's happening. He knows that I went on a racetrack. And uh, he's just happy that I'm representing the company, actually, being out here. Yeah. And, uh, and that somebody took an interest to, to do something like this. So, and this is my thing. I like being around trucks. I like being around old trucks, and I love truck trees.